with Takashi 69 baby mom Sarah goes on live and she exposes a lot of stuff. She exposes like fake friends, things that happen, how she left uh, 69 before he did that interview with the Breakfast Club and got locked up and she's pretty much done with him and he never calls from jail and everything. She doesn't really care. She just wants him out of her life. So, you know, it's kind of interesting here. Let's get into this uh, Jordan Tower JT News. Hit that bell, hit the subscribe button, and I'll play the live right now so you can check out what she's saying. But 6 9 uh, I guess he moved on and tried to make her mad with this other girl, Jade. It really confused. Like, there's so much going on with this kid right when he went to jail. There was so much going on with this kid for a whole year that I was like, yo, okay. So, like, I guess his baby mom just, like, you know, took the daughter and just left. And, uh... You know, he was trying to make her jealous or something. But now he's locked up and he's not even, you know, calling his daughter or anything for Christmas or anything. It's just really spooky. Um, I don't know. But um, listen to it. Let me know what you guys think about the whole thing. I think it's really weird. Um, I'll check you guys in the next video. But check this out. Get in the comment box below and I'll let you know. Peace. Also, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She also goes off on academics, too. Uh, I don't know. She said a lot of stuff here. She said academics was using 6 9 mm, I don't know. We'll see. Check it out. Peace. Look, y'all, y'all use your common sense. He did that interview, so he didn't know nobody. So I always hold him down. Freaking posted a picture with me and him after that. Dubbed him. Didn't want to be with him after that. Like, too much was already done, especially on his part. Claimed whoever he was claiming. And it's just, I don't know, just showing out, I guess, for IG. Like, I just don't want no parts. I'm literally on my own stuff. I don't want to talk to nobody. That's why I'm asking y'all. Like, I'm not even trying to ride no clout or nothing. I would actually appreciate it if y'all didn't, um... Be like, oh, how 6 9 Or like fan pages, 6 9 fan pages. That's cute and all, but it's just like, I don't need that. I'm not with him. The only attachment that is there and that's valid is my daughter. Like, have you spoken to him? No. He only calls his girlfriend and I think his mom, so it's just like, no, he doesn't call me or my daughter, so mm. it doesn't bother me. Like I said, me and my daughter be straight regardless. They, people want to see you down, and it's just like it gets under the skin that they know you fucking blessed out the ass like crazy. Like I have family, I have people who fuck with me. I have amazing fucking fan base. Like, fucking Cactus Gang know what the fuck it is. Like, I don't need to sit here and pick fights with people. I'm paying this fucking chick. She literally be liking fucking hate pages, follows them. Anything that has anything to bash me, she'll do it. And it's just like, I done seen her go on live with bitches Danny's cheated on me with. And I've done seen her befriend them or talk to them or whatever. It's like on some weird shit. Like, and you know why? Because they share one thing in common. They was never claimed and all they did was get fucked. And I think it really bothered her that, like, even though it wasn't so publicly that he did it, he never hit me either. Like, in almost every interview he's ever done, guess who he mentioned? Sarah. Because Sarah's always held it down. And I'm just not for it no more. Seven years and... Uh, like seven years and you're at where you're at and there's no progression there's no nothing like this like I didn't I couldn't do it no more so I don't know the I don't know none of those girls I can say I don't know them I've never met them a day in my life but I don't know why she's so sensitive and pressed for like her daughter look just like her Look, he don't even give us a call, so don't be asking me no stupid questions, which I think. Don't ask me what he bought for his daughter. I don't know. Okay.
Did he buy anything for the baby? I don't know. What did he buy? I don't know. Like, a lot. My daughter needs more than a toy. Or toys for Christmas. And she got a shit ton of, shit ton of those. So, I mean. My daughter's good. I'm like, finally done. And he saw that. It's like, I don't know how you in jail and you still trying to hurt me. It's like, I ain't heard about it. I'm fine. I mean, I don't care. Hi. If you're not going to join my life, like, if you're not going to be on a split screen with me, I don't care. Like, when you tell me to add you and we can have a talk, because that seems like the only way you'll get a talk, get, talk to me, is if they're able to gain something from it or whatever you think you're gaining viewers likes follows seems like the shade won't post anybody i don't know she's commenting well for her to comment something now because i don't see her I'll tell you something now that i'm here talking my shit Academics is such a fucking bozo. Academics, and I can talk all the shit I want. He's such a fucking bitch. Fucking. I didn't like academics because I felt like he was just so fucking sleazy before, but not that I had so much of a big, big issue. With him. My issue is now, after Danny gets locked up, and all this shit comes out, like, here and there through TMZ and all this other daily posts or whatever. There was a statement somewhere along those lines saying, 6 9 is worried for the safety of his family. And if 6 9 was such a friend, if Danny was your friend, I, even if that was the case, if Danny feared for us while he was inside, like me and his daughter... Why would you put mine and my daughter's picture out there, broadcast it on your fucking YouTube, YouTube channel, and put us out there like that? What if niggas was really after us? After us, You just was worried so much about fucking getting a fucking click and views and shit like that, and a fucking something to put on your channel, that you put us out there like that. What if something would have happened to me and my daughter? After that video. You fucking fat fuck. Like that's supposed to be your friend, right? You use Danny. That fat ass nigga know I don't like him. No, I was missed on the ground. I was off the ground for a whole month. Too much shit was going on. I ain't want to see it. <laughs> Niggas is like, oh, she's the feds. How? Like, I'm not that evil of a fucking person. If I really wanted to, to get back at him, I'm not even going to say I could just, like, take a book deal I've been offered. I could do a movie. Or I could do all this other shit. I could sell my story. My seven years was 6 9 Like, come on now. Like, I was like, so you say you're not pregnant now, right? Even if she reply, I'm not even going to reply back to her. Shorty, I proved my point already. Mm. I ain't do nothing to you. I ain't bother you. I ain't say shit to you. You the one saying something to Indirectly saying something to <laughs> She commented again. Fight with me. Leave me alone, girl. God is blessing me, and he just blessed you, so focus and worry on that. <laughs>